after you do all your cuticle work you are going to file and shape the nails i am going for an almond oval shape so i'm using a slim nail file and filing from side to center in kind of like a sweeping motion just to clean those edges then I'm going to buff the nails. This is going to take away the shine. It's also going to help with removing any excess oils that are on the nail plate and really help your gel polish adhere properly to the nail. You can go in again. I'm using this slightly more gritty file in a 240 grit just to get around the cuticle area. This is a prime area for lifting. So I want to make sure I've got rid of any extra cuticle that I might have missed during the cuticle work stage. And you can just sweep that across the nail and get in down the side walls. Then I'm going to wipe the nails. This is key. I'm using acetone just to clean away any dust or debris that's on the nail. And again, this will help remove any natural oils temporarily for the base coat. I'm going to use the 14 day manicure base coat, a super thin layer. This really helps longevity. So this gives you like that sticky layer for your builder gel to stick to which will help make sure your builder gel lasts as long as possible. And I'm making sure to work a super thin layer in here as well and avoiding the cuticle. This is gonna be cured for 30 seconds. And now I'm going in with Candy Crunch. This color, guys, stunning. It's like a perfect milky pink. So for the first layer, I'm not working too thick, but I'm placing um, a blob of the gel basically about a couple of millimeters away from the cuticle line and I'm working back towards the free edge trying not to make it too thick but equally I want a nice layer cure that for 99 seconds I'm going to do all the other nails too paying special attention to the edges of the nail this is where your nails can be most vulnerable and if you're using a builder gel you want that extra strength it provides so again I'm working this from the cuticle all the way down and curing for 99 seconds second coat this is a thinner coat this will help even out the color because i'm going to leave them as they are because i love the shade and again i'm just slowly tapering it down the nail paying special attention at the end to capping that free edge that will prevent any chipping of the polish and will really add to the strength so cure your second coat for 99 seconds as well and then to finish off i'm using the 14 day manicure no wipe top coat I love this top coat because it's no wipe. I find it's actually super shiny. Cure that for 60 seconds and check out the finished look. What do you think? This to me is the perfect healthy nude pink um, and I'm going to style it up with some rings. Why not? Um, I think it's the perfect winter pink too. You can paint over these if you want, but I'm absolutely leaving them as they are. It is gorgeous and most of all, my nails are super strong now.